Only time you put trust, your trust in, is in God, not in man. It is in God. And this God is Jesus Christ of Nazareth. So many presidents that came to America, I don't know, I'm talking about America, I don't know why. Honestly, I wasn't thinking about it. Something happening. I'll say this to the next president. And I want the next president to hear this and hear it very, very carefully. The next time you stand and you say, God, bless America you better say Jesus Christ of Nazareth who is this God if you say God and you stop at God you are not respecting Jesus why aren't you saying may God who is Jesus Christ of Nazareth bless America why are you afraid of saying it why who are you trying not to offend? Certain people behind the scenes? Or the people that live in your country who are non-Christians? Listen. When I talk about Jesus, now it's me. Now, When I talk about the Lord, it's got nothing to do with anyone. I'm not talking about the Lord in the hope that I offend someone. No, quite the contrary. I'm talking about the Lord because this is it. This is the truth. I can't fabricate things. I can't falsify things. I can't twist and bend things. I have to say it as is. Jesus Christ is God revealed in the flesh. Now, you want to accept it or not, it's your choice. You want to be offended by it or not, that was not my intention at all. But just because you got offended, that's not going to stop me from saying it again and again and again and until the last breath of this life which Jesus Christ gave this piece of wreck. I'll always say it. So God, who is Jesus Christ, bless America. Otherwise, Mr. President, America is gone. The next election is decisive. The people of America, they need to wake up. And the next president need to be extremely clear on how they gather themselves and talk. The Lord, the Lord will discipline any and every nation that once upon a time believed in him and now walked away from him, he will definitely bring that nation to its knees and make an example of it before the whole world.